Hey fam, what's up y'all? My bad y'all, I don't have my glasses on again for this video, so it's gonna be a little iffy, but welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you are new, Adventures with Moo. Uh, my name is Ramu, I go by Moo for short, feel free to call me whatever the hell you want, you know, whatever. But um, as you guys can see from today's video title, I am going to be doing a little video on um, why I choose not to wear my hijab. And as a Muslim woman, like obviously I don't know why you wear a hijab if you're not Muslim, but why I choose to not wear my hijab. So, um, ooh, this door is open, is the window? Y'all, it's snowing right now. I swear to God, it's snowing. I went crazy. It's, what is it? It's like February 1st, February 2nd. It's snowing outside anyway, it's crazy as hell. So, I grew up in a Muslim household. Um, obviously, both of my parents are Muslim. Uh, they're pretty strict I guess they would say like obviously I was where I was allowed to like listen to music and dance and do things like that but they would always encourage us to pray five times a day I wouldn't say encourage more like force but you know whatever pray five times a day whatever so um, when I was younger I did that a lot you know like I wore the headscarf like when I got to middle school I, sh I started wearing the headscarf because like you're at the age where you are becoming a woman where you kind of wear the hijab as this like as a sign of modesty and like you know, all of, of the reasons why we wear a hijab as women is why I started to wear one. So, um, let's see. I think the very first time that I took off my hijab was, I think it was like a few weeks into me starting middle school. And like, you know, like I had my little friends, like I hung out with a lot of black people and Latinas. So like, they didn't really care like how I looked or like what my, um, like, what I looked like with my hijab when I had it on because like you know they knew me whatever like I had friends who also wore the hijab as well so you know we were all just like you know gang 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 whatever but then when I like started to meet other students and interact with other students I would feel so uncomfortable in the room because students would always come up to me or like I would like hear them say things like oh my god like I bet she's a terrorist blah 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 you know like because I'm wearing the hijab I would feel like people wouldn't want to come up to me and talk to me because I was wearing it I felt unattractive because I was wearing it because like other girls like they had their long pretty hair out and like I was just like I had this hijab on and like it never really matched my clothes and I was just so like I was like you know what why don't I just take it off so I think it was like my mom would always drive me to school and if you are a Muslim girl and you have like grew up in America the way that I did where it's not like normal or encouraged to wear a hijab whatever because people will ridicule you because, will ridicule you because of it when my mom would drop me off at school, I would take my hijab off, you know, like she would drop me off, I would go run into the bathroom after I get my breakfast and take my hijab off and then, boom, my day started. So like I just got into that routine of doing that until my mom and dad found out that I wasn't wearing my hijab. Of course they didn't like it, but I mean they can't force me to do something that I don't want to do. And just ever since then I just haven't really worn it, like I've, obviously as you guys can see like I have my, my braids in, like I do my hair um, pretty religiously. <laughs> religiously well I do it like you know I try to keep it and maintain it because my hair is out and shown and I think just why I haven't reverted back to wearing my hijab is just, I'm just used to having my hair out now like I feel like wearing a hijab or not wearing a hijab doesn't make me a better or a worse Muslim I know that there are some Muslim sisters out there who will wear the full niqab who will wear all that stuff and be doing the most hoest dirtiest haram shit ever but then there are also girls who don't wear the hijab, not saying that that's me, but who like pray five times a day and worship Allah and you know, do all the amazing things that you're supposed to do as a Muslim. So, I don't know, like I mean, honestly, I don't, would I ever like go back to wearing my hijab? I mean, it's a very difficult question to answer because like, I'm just so used to not wearing it. And like if I go out and I wear it, it'll be like, kind of like, I don't know, just different, just strange for me whatever but if I do ever like want to wear it or if it's during Ramadan like I feel comfortable now like being able to go out and wear it because I don't give a fuck like I don't care what anybody has to say I don't care like what rules there are like if I want to wear it I'll wear it if I want to but it's just not something that that I do and it it doesn't make me any better or less of any better or worse of a Muslim so I mean yeah I don't wear it, I do when I want to, but I don't that often because it usually just doesn't like work with my fit, whatever. But that's just like so minuscule. I mean, just, I love, when I wear my hijab, I do feel very modest and very, um, 
I don't know what the word is, close to Allah, but it's just not something I wear. And yeah, I mean, that's all. If you guys have any questions or if you wear a hijab and you have had any struggles with it, please comment below. Let's start a conversation. We can talk about this because I know that there are some people who believe that to be like a, like the very good Muslim, you have to wear your hijab, you know, all the time if you're around men in public, whatever. But I don't believe that. Call me what you want. I'm not like a scholar. Like, yes, I know what the Quran says, but that's just not what I do. So haters, comment below. Lovers, comment below. Let's 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 talk about this, okay? Let's talk about this. So that's all I have to say. Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, you know, I hope you guys have a great, wonderful evening, morning, or night. And thank you for watching this. I hope you learned something. Make sure to comment your thoughts and opinions below. Thanks, guys.